if measure of angle DCE equals 4x plus 15, and measure of angle ECF equals 6x minus 5, find the measure of angle DCE. One thing to notice is above that in bold, it tells us that in the figure CE bisects angle DCF. So that means that Again, CE means that breaks apart this as well as this. Those are both the same value. So DCE is 4x plus 15. And ECF, ECF is 6x minus 5. And then we want to find the measure of angle DCE. So first of all, we need to figure out how big is X. And once again, 4X plus 15 is going to be equal to 6X minus 5. Solve it the way your Algebra 1 teacher taught you. I'm going to move my letter to the left by subtracting 6X from both sides. And we get negative 2X plus 15 equals negative 5 and then we're going to subtract 15 from both sides get negative 2x equals negative 20 and finally we can divide both sides by negative 2 so x equals 10 now we don't really care that x equals 10 what we want to know is how big is angle DCE well the measure of angle DCE is 4x plus 15, but we're going to take the value of 10 that we just found and put it back in here. So it's 4 times 10 plus 15, which is 40 plus 15. So our measure of angle DCE is 55.